I've thought about a thousand times the what ifs, I mean, that's kind of nauseating that we were that close. In my time as district attorney, we have had some odd cases. This one was a complete roller coaster ride towards the end. As far as an emotional situation, this was by far um, the toughest one. Tracy Harris was a hardworking young mother that disappeared March 7th, 1990. She was a very sweet friend, a very shy person, and people really liked her and respected her. Her daughter was a toddler, a four-year-old named Carolyn, who she had with Carl Harris. She had been married for several years. They had recently divorced, but had never really split. They still lived in the same home. They slept in the same bed. I did hear that Tracy was missing and was very concerned something had happened to her. Carl came by our house. She'd been missing for a couple days. He was genuinely concerned, and he said, you know, I can see her leaving me, but she would never leave this baby. Her body was discovered about 150 yards further downstream, about seven days before she went missing. Based on the autopsy, the manner of death was homicide. Tracy was a kind and loving person who did not deserve what happened to her. Most people did think that Carl Harris had murdered Tracy. Prior to her going missing, there had been a confrontation or two concerning a girlfriend that Carl had. Carl Harris did have a reputation for being very violent, in particular towards Tracy Harris. There were several instances where the witnesses would say it didn't take anything for him to just go off on her. He was incredibly abusive to her. I never put my hands on Tracy, never. So all of those people were lying? Yes, ma'am. I love Tracy. She was the love of my life. I think from the very get-go, there was only one suspect in this case, Carl Harris. Everybody thought I killed her. Everywhere I turned, they, they, you know, you'd hear them whispering in the background, there's the man that killed Tracy. A lot of people were, were waiting for him to be arrested and then surprised when he never was. Ozark Police Department had created a cold case unit. And in 2016, they picked up the Tracy Harris, Carl Harris case. They told me they were looking at me as, as a suspect again after 27 years. The evidence was circumstantially strong. The domestic violence, the circumstance with the girlfriend, and comments he made that she wouldn't be back. Who else would want this sweet, innocent young lady murdered? Jordan and her team had spent a lot of time building a case that I was about to torpedo. I kept the secret for 30 years.